Hello there. The first week of September is looking a lot more summery than what we had throughout most of July and indeed August. This weekend, high pressure is building in. It will turn drier and sunnier and warmer across the board. It's a weekend and we're talking about sunshine. It's something we haven't talked about for quite a long time, I have to say. Yeah, uh, the weather is turning more summery now that we're into autumn. So we're looking at some dry weather today with some warm, sunny spells. Um, it's looking fine this weekend. For a long time, we haven't seen weather like this. Uh, some sunshine in the forecast. Look at this. This morning, a lovely sunrise, although it is quite misty out there. We've got some fog patches to contend with first thing this morning. A bit of cloud also around the southeast of England. Hello. Yeah, good morning. Yeah, this is the scene at the moment in the uh, north coast of Northern Ireland. Looking lovely there, isn't it? We've had a bit of uh, coastal and uh, hill fog and some mist around this morning, but it's going to be a beautiful day, I think, for most of us. The first time for a weekend that we've seen in a long time, actually. Let's, uh, let's link into that because it's been a, a lovely start to the day, actually, for many of us. Because we've had some mist and fog first thing this morning. Some of that's still around, but some blue skies. Look at that in uh, Devon right at the moment with some light winds, really quite calm conditions there uh, on the sea. This is all looking pretty rosy if you want a bit of sunshine in early September. Yeah, let's face it, throughout August there wasn't a great deal of sunshine. It was pretty wet for some of us as well. Uh, not great for the summer holidays. But of course, kids have gone back to school or will be going back to school next week. And guess what? The weather's going to change. Sun's out. Yep, sunshine. Yes, good morning, everybody. We had some early morning mist and fog, but a beautiful start to the day here at uh, Chatsworth. It's a perfect day, actually, for hot air balloonists because we've got high pressure and light winds, so uh, pretty good lifting conditions at the moment. Um, yeah, morning, we've uh, got some fine weather. Summer weather on the way. Of course, now it's turned to autumn, meteorologically speaking, Obviously. of course. Uh, but it looks a bit autumnal at the moment, actually, doesn't it? But some fog, mist and fog out there. Uh, that's Corf Castle. That's the scene right now. Um, and uh, there is quite a bit of fog, actually, but it is starting to clear away. Very un-Arctic, like Antarctic whatever weather. <laughs> Absolutely, yeah. We've, we've had summer, of course, July and August, which for many of us has been, I think, pretty disappointing. Uh, but now, as we go into the weekend and next week, now we're in August, uh, sorry, now we're in autumn, things are looking much more uh, improved. Look at this sunshine this morning in Gwynedd. But again, widely, look at that, temperatures in the low to the mid-20s on Monday afternoon. Through the rest of the week, as I said, temperatures will continue to rise, especially for England and Wales. So look at this, 25 to 28. We could see 30 Celsius perhaps in uh, parts of southern England on Wednesday or Thursday. And with these sort of temperatures, we could be reaching the threshold criteria. So uh, we could see a heat wave for some parts of England and Wales as we go through next week. Looks wonderful. Thank you, Simon. All right. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Thank you.